So let's be completely honest. Escanor is really strong. Really strong. Like, he's considered probably number one of the seven deadly sins. Strongest so far. Probably number one. We all thought, you know, when we first watched Seven Deadly Sins, it was most definitely Meliodas, you know what I'm saying? He, he's, you know, demon from the demon clan, son of the, you know, the demon that lives in hell and all that. You know, god of all demons, all that, yeah. And he's the oldest son of them, yeah, but not nah, Escanor is the strongest. I believe Escanor is capable, and I'm, I'm I, no, I believe this to be true. He's able of one-shotting all three demon brothers, the strongest. He can one-shot Estorosa, he can one-shot Meliodas, and he can one-shot Deldris. Seems that way in his fight with uh, Estorosa at first, let's be honest. It seems like if he really wanted to just finish him off just on a snap of a finger, he could have done that. Let's be honest. And with Meliodas, yes, if he just used that form he used, why do I just forget what it's called at the moment? He would have ended him right then and there, but, you know, I'm guessing he was also trying to save him too, not just give himself a challenge. But, let's be let's be honest, Meliodas put up a very, very decent fight. I know people are going to say, eh, it's from the art style. No, it was crappy, the fight could have been so much better. Eh, I, I didn't mind it. I just, I, I kind of just wanted to see Meliodas win, I'm not going to lie, because I like him. But, you know, it seemed like Escanor, like, the match was over before it started type, type of fights. But let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Give me a like, comment, subscribe. Share the video, and I will see you next time.